How to Create Amazon Affiliate Website in Google Sites. Hello and welcome to our channel, WebOS. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create Amazon Affiliate Website in Google Sites. So please watch till the end to properly understand the tutorial. So the first thing that you need to do is to open your browser and kindly go to sites.google.com. Or you can simply type on Google, Google Sites, and just click the first link that come up. Or alternatively, just click the link in the description below. And you will be directed in here. In which below here, it will show you the other options such as blank, family update, portfolio, event, and help center. And to start creating a website, can you click the blank page. And upon clicking on it, you will be directed in here. And as you can see on the right side panel, some of the editing tools that you can use. In which under the insert section, you will see here the text box, the images, embed, drive, and below is the content blocks or the layout that you want to add in your site. And as you can see here, you have the variety of choices that you can choose. Or alternatively, under the theme section, by clicking on it, it will show you some of the themes that you can consider that will serve as your theme in your website. We have Aristotle, Simple, Vision, Level, and many more. And as you can see, the themes are only limited since Google Sites is often used for creating simple websites, intranets, project portals, and internal wikis. While under the Pages section, you will see here that you can add a menu section by clicking on it and selecting or customizing the name. You can also add new page, new link, and many more. So let's try first by customizing our website using insert option, such as in this page title, we can customize this by clicking on it and entering the name of our website. And for example, I'm going to enter this as Amazon Finds. While on the corner, you could also add additional name or alternatively, you could add your logo. But I'm going to choose to enter the site name, so I'm going to enter WebWiz. And now below, we could also customize this by adding the specific product that you want to add in your website. And in order to do that, all we need to do is to go to Amazon.com. So on the next tab, under the Amazon.com, you could select any of the product that you want to add to your Google Sites. And in choosing the product that you want to select, make sure that it is popular and contain a 5-star review and of course has a cheaper price. So just go on the search bar and kindly search the product that you want to add to your Google Sites in creating Amazon Affiliate Websites. So I'm choosing pants, and in this pants, I'm going to choose the cheaper one. And upon clicking on it, you will be directed in here, in which as you can see on the left side panel, some of the images or preview of what the pants or product looks like. While on the right side panel, you will see here the description of this product, the ratings or star ratings by the customer, and of course, the corresponding price of this product. So from here, the next thing that we need to do is to save these images and after downloading this image the next thing that we need to do is to insert it in our google sites so just go back to your google sites and from here just click this plus button in here and proceed by selecting the upload option in which upon clicking on it all you need to do is to select an image that we just download and import it in this website and after that you can now start customizing the image or resizing it to make it look formal and to show the free view of this product. And now the next thing that we need to do is to enter or customize the description of it. And to do that, just go back to your Amazon and from here just copy all this context and after copying the context of it, just go back to your Google Sites and just paste the context that we just copy. And after pasting the context in here, you can now start customizing the font, the size, or even the color of this context. You can even set this as bold, italic, underlined, and many more. So I'm gonna make this context as Arial size 18 and make it bold. And after customizing the title of the product, the next thing that we need to do is to add the description of this product from Amazon. And to do that, just click the context line below and proceed on Amazon and just scroll down on the left side panel and just select and copy the description 
of this product. And after successfully copying the description of it, just go back to this Google Sites and just paste the description that we just copy. And aside from that, we could also customize the description context, including its font style, the size of it to make it bold, underlined, or even change its color. But I'm going to stick to its default size and font. Now, the next thing that we need to do is to link the picture of this product to Amazon. And to do that, kind of click on this and it will show you the options above and proceed by clicking insert link. And upon clicking on insert link, it will show you the space in which you can paste the link in here. So just go back to amazon.com and just copy the link of it or URL. And after copying, just paste it in this Google Sites. And proceed by clicking apply button. So this will be helpful if the visitor try to click the images, they will be directed on the Amazon in which they can order the product that we have in our Google Sites. Now, the next thing that we need to do is to add a button that says Buy Now. And in order to do that, just click the Insert section and below here, just scroll down until you find the button option. So, kind of click on here and after that, just customize the name of this button. So, I'm going to enter a name Buy Now. And as you can see, below the name, you will see here the link. And all you need to do is to just paste the link on Amazon of this product in here. And after that, just proceed by clicking the insert button in here. And after that, it will show you that the buttons is now ready. So we just need to edit or customize by dragging the button to make it look formal and pleasing to the eyes of the visitor. And aside from that, you could also customize the context, including the font style, the font size, the color of it, or even to make it bold, underlined, or italic. And now, after customizing your website as an Amazon affiliate website, all you need to do is to click the publish button on the top right corner. And you could also customize your web address for publishing this website. But in this case, I'm going to choose to stick with this web address. So just proceed by clicking the publish button below and after that it will show you that your website has now been successfully published. And to view the result or website, and you click the view button below here and you will be directed in your Amazon affiliate website. As you can see here, this is the simple website that we just create using Google Sites. And below here, if we try to click the picture we should be able to be directed on Amazon website. And also by clicking the buy now button below here, it should also be direct us in the Amazon website. As you can see, this is also what the visitor will see if they try to visit our Amazon affiliate website. So that is just how to create Amazon affiliate website in Google Sites. Thank you.